guys and welcome to episode 8 of Dragon Age. This is the second time I'm recording this episode. I have found out the hard way that uh, the Elgato cannot handle uh, processing a video and recording at the same time. So the file ended up getting corrupted and I couldn't use it. The legions of evil are on your doorstep. They will feast upon our hearts. There is nowhere to run. This evil will cover the world like a plague of locusts! Please, you're scaring the children! Better to slit their throats now than let them suffer at Darkspawn hand! There! One of their minions is already amongst us! This woman bears their evil stench! Can you not see the vile blackness that fills her? Why don't you keep your voice down? I watch the Black Horde descend on my people! I will not be silent! Please stop! Somebody shut his mouth! But isn't he right? The ban left us. We're going to die. This minion is but the first of those who will destroy us! What happened to you? My family. My clan. Those creatures butchered them all. Some of us fled here, but we cannot escape the dog spawn. I can yell too. Um, must have been horrible. I, I ran, hearing my wife screams as they dragged her off. She had hair the same color as yours. Sorry for your loss. Why am I here? I should not have gone. <laughs> He was right, wasn't he? There's no hope for us. There's always hope. You're right. We can't give up. But we can't fight. What are we supposed to do? We can't lie down and die either. We must go north to dinner him. Makes perfect sense to me. Alright. I don't want to go in the chantry just yet. It is over. Why am I not getting like stopped for going through everyone's crap? Like, I highly doubt this is actually my stuff. That depends. She's really tall, and she has red hair. We live on a big farm hold, all of us. Some mean men with swords came, and Mother told me to run to the village as fast as I could, so I did. She said she'd be right behind me, but I've been waiting and waiting, and I can't see her. Uh, come with me. Mother said I wasn't to go with anyone. I'm supposed to wait for her here, in the village. Go to the Chantry. I will, but only if I don't find Mother first. You're a really nice lady. Kind of like Mother. I should go look for her. Do not enjoy your Templar training? That's directed at me, I take it. Do you see any others about who have failed at their religious instruction? I didn't fail. I was recruited into the Grey Wardens. And if you had not been recruited, what would have happened instead? I would have turned into a drooling lunatic, slaughtered the Grand Cleric, and run through the streets of Denham in my small clothes, I guess. Your self-awareness does you credit. I thought you'd like that. All right, I also forgot to tell you, I gave TJ some more paint. I forgot exactly what it does, but it boosts his stats up. And then I gave Morgan this clothing, mostly because I was sick of looking at her being so cold. Just kidding, this stuff's better. It has, um, I think, better spear resistance than something else. Hello, uh, stranger. I don't suppose you know anyone that can make traps? 
I'm quite familiar with traps. I would happily pay you to make them. There's wood and nails and other goods around the village in the forest. But you probably already know that. Sorry. Come back if you make some. Alright. Poison and traps. Let's make this chicks and traps. Let's make four spring traps. So why not? Did you did you make any traps? I have traps. Oh, what a relief. Thank you, stranger. Wait. Glowing. Thanks. No, I don't want to talk to you again. The traps. I feel safer already. Stop looking at me, mongrel. I have nothing you want. Why do you keep staring at me so, you flea-ridden beast? Can you not tell when you are not wanted? I enjoy company of creatures of the wild, not stench-ridden domesticated wolves. And he persists! Maddening! Master Felleron runs us miners hard. Harder still since Austin. Okay. You got a bed for the night. You taken care of. <laughs> Actually, I was hoping I could help Don't you. We need blades right now. We need beds, food, and an end to all these sad sots. I don't suppose you know anything of tonics, medicines, or herbs. I don't, but my friend does. And you may be able to do us a lot of good. All manner of travelers come through, many injured or sick. We do our best, but we're out of supplies. There's medicinal herbs in the woods to the north. If you make a few poultices, I'll scrape together some sort of payment. I'll write all you need to know in this note here. I think... It's in potion? No. Can't be in poison and traps, right? Talents? No. Advanced? No. Sustain? No, no. That's not it. That's poison, though. Where is this? Maybe I have to do it as Morgan. Ugh. Yes, okay. I should probably make like some of these. <laughs> Indeed. Whoops. Have any luck finding herbs in the woods? This will help many people. You're a good sort, you know. So, Lothering is probably going to be split into two parts, because there's so many little quests here. I'm going to be sticking mainly to the inside portion of Lothering. How dare you accuse me of thievery! Uh, and then next I episode, saw you take the supplies from my car! The carnage we left in the wild Your was Your grassland eyes are inept! A chase end would there's never stoop to petty to theft! People. You it must be worth it thing. anyway. Chakra. Uh, this is going to be one of our companions. His name is Sten. He's a canary born without horns. You want one of my captors? I will not amuse you any more than I have the other humans. Leave me in peace. I'm in a cage, am I not? I've been placed here by the Chantry. I am Sten of the Beresad, the vanguard of the Kunari peoples. I'm Melissa. Pleased to meet you. You mock me. Or you show manners I have not come to expect in your lands. Though it matters little now, I will die soon enough. This is a proud and powerful creature, trapped as prey for the Darkspawn. If you cannot see a use for him, I suggest releasing him for mercy's sake alone. Mercy? I wouldn't have expected that from you. I would also suggest that Alistair take his place in the cage. Yes, that's what I would have expected. I suggest you leave me to my fate. I find myself in need of skilled help. No doubt. What help do you seek? I'll land against the, the blight. blight. Are you a Grey Warden then? Yes, I am. Surprising. My people have heard legends of the Grey Warden's strength and skill. Though I suppose not every legend is true. 
Um, would the revered mother Perhaps let you if free? you told her the Grey Wardens need my assistance. It seems as likely to bring my death as waiting here. I'll leave for Farewell now. then. Eaten alive by Darkspawn. That's cruel. I wonder why the revered mother's so afraid of him. I said enough. Okay. Stan is probably a. Uh, I won't say my favorite character, but he's kind of funny. So Terran that was a great description a of how much Not I liked him. He's kind of funny. Ah, I don't want do to talk to you. I heard that he may have had some to do with the king's it's death. So annoying! Oh god! It's so annoying that the that characters get so close to you that you accidentally talk to them all the time. Nonsense. Well, look what we have here, then. I think we've just been blessed. Uh oh. Logan's men. This can't be good. Didn't we spend all morning asking about a woman by this very description, and everyone said they hadn't seen her? It seems we were lied to. Gentlemen, surely there's no need for trouble. These are no doubt simply more poor souls seeking refuge. They're more than that. Now stay out of our way, sister. You protect these traitors, you'll get the same as them. talk about this before things get out of hand. I doubt he would listen. He blindly follows his master's commands. I am not the blind one. I served at Ostagar, where the turn saved us from the Grey Warden's treachery. I serve him gladly. Enough talk. Take the Warden into custody. Kill this sister and anyone else that gets in your way. Right. Let's make this quick. More enemies ahead! So Liliana is possible bay number two. I shall do it. Well, not opposed. Wow. Very romantic her. I shall do it just rather not. But if you guys want me to do it, it's a fine thing we've done. All right, you've won. We surrender. Good. They've learned their lesson and we can all stop fighting now. Um, the, take a message to Logan. W what do you want to tell him? You'll have to do better than this. I'll tell him right away now. Thank you. I apologize for interfering, but I couldn't just sit by and not help. And who are you anyhow? Let me introduce myself. I am Liliana. One of the lay sisters of the Chantry here in Lothring. Oh, I was. Um, I'm Melissa. A pleasure. Those men said you're a Grey Warden. You will be battling the Darkspawn, yes? That is what Grey Wardens do. I know after what happened, you will need all the help you can get. That's why I'm coming along. Why, so you're to come with me? The Maker told me to. Can you elaborate? I... I know that sounds absolutely insane, but it's true. I had a dream. A vision. More crazy? I thought we were all full up. Look at the people here. They are lost in their despair, and this darkness, this chaos, will spread. The Maker doesn't want this. What you do, what you are meant to do, is the Maker's work. Let me help. Very well, I will not turn away help when it's offered. Perhaps your skull was cracked worse than Mother thought. Thank you. I appreciate being given this chance. I will not let you down. Um, I'll wait till I can give her better clothes to bring her to the party. And TJ has level up. I don't think he has a skill point. S skill point? A skill point, though. What was. Oh, okay. <laughs> also, I think I meant. I don't know if I mentioned this last video or when I recorded this episode for the first time. You're here about food. Take it up with that bleeding runt by the chantry. I got other gear to sell. But there's some armor that, uh. I want uh, my character to wear, but it requires skill of 20, I think, so I'd have to spend the next level ups, next three level ups to put it all into strength. So I'll probably do that.
Uh, know of any work? Check the chanter's board by the chantry. There's good jobs, huh? Uh, <clears throat> I don't suppose you know anything about, uh, poison? I have dabbled in such things. I figured if I kept asking, I'd find someone. I'd pay good coin for some simple poison. Something to slow them beasties down or make them think twice. I'll see what I can do. Thanks. I, I might have some ingredients in stock. Don't really know what you need. Farewell. So anyone who's played Dragon Age Inquisition might know why I have uh, reservations about romancing Liliana. Impossible. Any luck with that poison? Or you're here to see my stock? Um, I have what you asked for. Splendid! Uh, if those beasties come on my land, I hope it teaches them a lesson. Yeah, it's enough gold to cover any of your expenses and then some, hey? Ha ha! She's not like a terrible person, she just... Is... It's hard to explain. But if you want me to romance her, I will. You speak to that knight yesterday. Said he was from Red. Okay, I think that's all the quests I can get in town here. So I think I'm gonna go back to the chantry and talk about Sten's imprisonment. So let's talk about you. Between episodes, I'll probably get my uh, my inventory all figured besides, out. Is it your mother, a scary witch who lives Squared in the away, middle of so a you guys don't have to watch that. Much Someone more interesting. Now. To you, perhaps. But it sounded like they were talking. Well, I guess I missed that, but whatever. It's not that important. Okay. There's word of darkspawn stragglers. There's no sign of the main hall. Who? I beg your pardon. I did not see you approach. Sir Donald? Is that you? Alistair? By the maker, how are you? I, I was certain you were dead. Not yet. No thanks to turn Loghain. If Arl Eamon were well, he'd set Loghain straight soon enough. If he were well? W w what do you mean? The Arl is stricken with an illness that threatens his life. We have found no cure, either natural or magical. When did this happen? Only a few weeks ago, but he has declined quickly. No one knows the nature of the illness, and even magic has done little to slow its progress. Our only hope now is a miracle. Every knight of Redcliffe has gone in search of the urn of sacred ashes. Andraste's ashes are said to cure any illness, but I fear we are chasing a fable. With each day, my hope dims. I was hoping to meet Arleman, in fact. Why is that, if I may ask? He need his help against Loghain. I see. The Arl is a popular man, it's true. Tern Loghain, however, is a hero throughout Ferelden. Whatever the Tern has done or not done, the Arl remains ill, or worse. That is my primary concern. Do you think Logan is involved with the illness? The Arl fell ill before the king died. But what if Logan planned that too? Oh, such thoughts do not sit well with me. We should see what's happening in Redcliffe ourselves. I believe that now more than ever. If nothing else, I am certain you would be welcomed at Castle Redcliffe. The Arlesser is there, and she could tell you more than I could. Your sir, your friend what? is dead. And you have his locket? And a note? Maker's mercy. Thank you for giving me these. I would never have known otherwise. Sorry about your friend. Thank you. I wonder how many of us have met similar fates on this mad quest. I should go. With Henrik gone, I need to return to Redcliffe. Perhaps later I will seek out the scholar his note mentions. But I must go. Thank you again, my lady. You have been most helpful. I decided to not ask him about the urn because you guys will learn about that later. A chant of light scattered in the dark. What will help? Please. 
Thank we you. came here to get away from the fighting. Come on. Those who seek redemption, the task is finished. Let those who have sinned be forgiven. Can't go up there for some reason. Apparently, I don't know how to use stairs. Let him hear our unwavering faith. Will you be making a donation to the Chantry, my friend? You look like you have salvaged more of value than most who make it here. Teeth to the ch Chantry. Um, don't want to say are you joking. What teeth is acceptable? Might I suggest thirty silver? That teething was taking one-tenth of everything you have and giving it to the church. So shouldn't I just give a tenth of my gold away? I don't, I don't know. I'll give you as much as These I can, whatever. These poor souls will care. weep at your generosity. Thank you. What can I do for you, then? I want to talk about Sten, the canary you have imprisoned. It might have been kinder to execute him, but I leave his fate to the Maker. Why does he interest you? I want him freed, I might have a use for him. Then his next victims might count you and me as their murderers. I just think you might release him into my custody. Your custody? And who might you be? <laughs> my father was Tyrion Kuzland. Mm. Since our ban has forsaken Lothering, perhaps you are the best choice for secular justice after all. Here then. Take the key to the Canary's cage and take him away. I pray this is the right path for all our sakes. Alright, this is where I'm going to end this episode. Um, next time we'll do all of the out in the field work for this area. It's going to be a lot of back and forth, going to the Chanter's board and going out into the field. And hopefully we'll end up moving on. But I will see you Only next time. Oops. I don't even know if any of you read this, but I guess it's a nice thing to do for the people who actually want to. It's not like it takes too much effort. know if the wilds was a thing we already looked at so I'm gonna scroll through it anyways in case we hadn't I think it's just the last thing that's uh, new This must be new too, since we just met her. I don't know if Morgan is new. Books and songs? Oh, I didn't open it. I feel like this is basically Robin Hood, but different. I don't know. I, I'm not actually reading it. I'm just skimming the parts that I see. Alright, that'll be all for the Codex section. I will see you guys.